What's going on guys in this part of Majora's Mask? I'm gonna tell you how to beat the uh, Deku Palace anyway So there are these gonna there are these two Deku girls here We can only get past them as Deku Link and uh, there's one piece of heart We want to get and there's one way we can get a piece of heart in this area, but we're actually first of all We're gonna select the pictograph box, and then we're gonna go into the King's room as you can tell, that monkey that's been held hostage in the last video has been held hostage for apparently kidnapping the daughter who went to the Woodfall Temple. But uh, anyway, one of the ways you can get that heart piece that I, meant, I was mentioning earlier is uh, take a picture of the uh, Deku game. This is actually not the way we're going to get the heart piece in this playthrough, but like um, we're basically going to, you know, well, I'm trying to say, I'm going to analyze both ways to get the heart piece. Anyway, so uh. We don't actually have uh, I don't know why I selected Deku nuts right there. We don't really need them for this part, but anyway, so um great from sneaking around. If you get caught by these Deku uh, guards, uh, you end up going back to the beginning. So uh yeah, we're entering the room that gets us the uh, piece of heart. I think I get caught on the first attempt, but uh Anyway, this is basically like sneaking past Zelda's guards in Ocarina of Time. Let's just wait till this asshole goes, because uh, you want to wait till they're completely out of the way. This one's overhead on like, you know, Zelda's guards knocking on. And there's uh, there's going to be a later point in the game that's also going to involve uh, sneaking past guards. Anyway, so, um... Is he gonna go? I think I make a run for it right here, then you get caught. Actually, no, I get the heart piece. Anyway, so I don't know what I was thinking right there, but anyway, I just get caught on purpose after you get the piece of heart. There is another way to get it, but like, this is like, I think, I just like to get it as early as possible. But what we actually have to do is that we have to go to the right area. This is the message you get every time uh, you get caught by one of the guards. If you actually enter the King's Room as Human Link, you'll just uh, end up getting thrown out. I think this is the area I get caught the first time. I'd say this one's harder to uh, sneak through because there's more guards. But there's going to be a hole at the very end. Yeah, I get caught right there. So, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna cut the footage too hard because, uh, I got caught in the very first room. But yeah, the right path, the left path only if you want the piece of heart, which I would recommend getting if you're doing a completion this round. That's, I'm saying the obvious right there. This video will go up to uh, when you, we uh, get the magic beans because that's actually we don't. This video will go up till we learn the Sonata of Awakening because that's all we have to do in this area. We're gonna come back here later and do a side quest. But anyway, we're out of that area. So get wait till this asshole is out of the way. There's definitely a lot of wait. There's a lot of waiting in Majora's Mask in general. To be fair, we'd have to wait till Zelda's guards are out of the way before we're playing Octon Con, which um, to be honest, I might do a video series of uh, this how to beat on Ocarina of Time because this year, uh, the latest this year, because uh, this game does mark its 25th anniversary. So I have been planning on that. Anyway, so this is where we get the uh, magic beans. I love how every time I see like uh, patches of grass. Anyway, so um, they're ten rupees each. We get one for free. So yeah, they're much less than they are in Ocarina of Time. Ten rupees, and uh, I would recommend getting two because uh, the first one we're just gonna um, we're just gonna plant in that little soil. It only gets us twenty rupees, but rupee you need rupees definitely a lot in this game if you're gonna do 100 percent so we're gonna get the rupees oh wait a minute wait a minute <laughs> i i drown i didn't even drown it's like yeah 
But yeah, we're actually gonna not hold it up like that. We're gonna plant it right there. Yeah, you need spring water to uh, actually get through these maps because you can't warp seven years in this game like you could in Ocarina of Time. Interesting thing is, there's a mask later in the game that had to take out one of the bosses, and it was actually originally going to be called the Adult Link's Mask, but it got scrapped during development. What? And we got 20 rupees, so, uh, yeah, now we're gonna get, now we're gonna go, and once you leave this, you take care of this area, I'd suggest just getting caught on purpose. Yeah, like that. Now we're done with this area, so we have to uh, go to this right, to, we have to go right, get across these lily pads. That shortcut right there is how we get to uh, the temple, but uh, we don't have, we can't do that yet. And I drowned again. And so this area right here is basically another one of those uh, magic bean areas. That's a bad jump. Anyway, that's a, this is a better jump, but um, for some reason we can't use magic beans as daking them for whatever reason. I don't know why. I'm not sure why they did that, but like, we have to be human, Link. Anyways, we get out of our uh, water. If you're gonna get that 20 rupees, make sure you do the uh, water, you do the spring water twice. You don't, you sh you shouldn't have two bottles at this point. Okay, so now that's uh that's uh there's gonna be uh some platforming, also uh, some really bad draw distance. Like look at that, look at that draw distance right there. Like, I know the N64 definitely has a lot of draw distance, but, like, that's some of the worst draw distance I've ever seen. But, hey, I'm not gonna judge a 20-year-old 20, 20 game by today's standards because I'm not fucking Aaron Hansen. I was actually, uh, in preparation for this, uh, for doing this, uh, series. I was watching the, uh, this is how you don't play montage of like the game Grumps is LP of Majora's Mask and like that basically inspired me to do this series is basically how to properly play the game because like there's a lot of people I see that like don't understand this game at all to be fair I don't really understand Breath of the Wild that much but that's a different thing So definitely kill these uh Deku, these Deku Babas because they're gonna be on platforms. And you make sure you don't fall because then you'll have to uh go back and do some shit. You have to do a few things again. Hold on, I'll cut the footage because uh. Anyway, so the reason I cut the footage was because I had to pause and do some do a few things like in my real life. <laughs> so um, we're gonna kill that uh, Deku Baba. It's actually almost the night of the first day, and we're gonna need to do a few things on the night of the first day, but uh, that'll be a thing for later. It's more completionist, but like, Majora's Mask is 80% side quest. You're gonna end up, wound up doing some of the side quests in this game. Like, the biggest pro, I would say the thing with Majora's Mask in general is that like, the side quests, like, I'd say the people that don't like this game are the kind, basically they play it like Ocarina of Time and they just run in and do all the temples, but Majora's Mask is a game you have to do a lot of the side quests and get all the upgrades and all that, like, um, for a better experience. And so Deku King's Chamber. We're gonna learn the uh, Sonata of Awakening. And I'm actually gonna sign it off while we're learning this song, so I'll see you guys next time. Bye.